Hello everyone, this is ET Studios and welcome to another video. So today I'm showing you a pretty cool tool I found the other day, which was actually made quite a while ago, but it allows you to put any picture you have in most formats into an LCD screen on Space Engineers, which I thought was really, really cool. So let's have a look at how to do that. First of all, uh, this uses a format called uh, monospace, so basically you go in here and you go to font, you scroll all the way down to monospace and that basically is a different font that converts text into uh, basically a pixel format. So let's open up the app I used to do this. So here we are inside the app. So basically you have here your tool which converts whatever picture into monospace and you just press generate monospace, monospace string you, and it copies it to your clipboard and you paste it into space engineers. So let me import a picture quickly and I'll just import this one which is a picture of the ship we use for our survival series, uh, link in description. And there we go, I've just moved around the box a bit to the right position and I've put it to custom. Now this is for a small, for a, for a square screen but you could also convert it for a large ship wide LCD panel and that'll give it a different shape. Then you press convert, it'll now convert over for the monospace so the resolution changes slightly, it doesn't look as nice but it's definitely good enough. Then you press generate monospace string and now we'll meet you back in Space Engineers. Okay, so now we're back in Space Engineers. We have copied our picture, so we now go and press F by our LCD screen. Control V to paste in, press OK. Now go into the menu, press display text on screen, and remember this. Now this will look like that right now, but lots of people forget you have to actually change the font size to be all the way down as far as it can to make it actually look like the right picture. So there we have it. It's a really cool tool I think. It allows you to put any of the pictures in. I've just got a few of the thumbnails from our previous videos and my channel icon over here. But I thought this was a really cool tool that not many people know about. So I just thought I'd teach you how to do it. So if you have any suggestions on what to use this tool for, if you have any creations that you've used this tool for, let me know in the comments below and I'll see you in the next video. Thank you everyone for watching and goodbye.